I look a little rough because I just did a video where I tried on like eight different pairs of contact lenses and my eyes were like nope so pretty much I lost most of my makeup and had to scramble to try to get it back on that's why it's like this and I've got like crap all over my face but I just wanted to do my videos back to back so I figured I'm just gonna go ahead and do my other one now while I'm in front of the camera so I had mentioned in a video that I just released a couple of, uh, by the time this comes out weeks or days ago that I was wanting to get back to myself and I was wanting to kind of um, you know start expressing myself and venting and ranting and just speaking my mind like I used to without having to be scared that you know somebody's not gonna like me or the hate sites are gonna run away with what I have to say and th things like that you know and by the time this comes out I would have released a rant video already but it's not a a really extreme rant video um, this one I decided to go ahead and get out of the way because this is probably the worst of the worst I know that 99% of people don't agree with this opinion that I have and this thing that's been bothering me for a while so I figured you know if you can agree or understand my side with this video then you'll be fine with anything else I have that I probably even gonna rant about um, if you just if you are just disgusted and turned off completely by this video then you probably won't want to stick around anyway so it's my way kind of of weeding out who who would cause trouble or you know just who doesn't really belong here I guess you could say I guess I don't really know how to say it and um, I figured I might as well start with the worst of the worst so I'm gonna do that um, I thought of doing this after I released my other video that's why this one isn't actually first but it's second which is still good enough now I already said that most people aren't gonna agree with this and I know that that's fine if you don't agree I don't expect you to this is my area this is my space to rant or vent or just get stuff off my chest nobody who listens has to agree no one who listens has to care I mean you're obviously listening so you must care about something whether it's disagreeing or agreeing or you're just morbidly interested in what this weirdo has to say but either way um, like I said I don't expect you to, to agree but I'm, I'm also not trying to necessarily shame anybody it's this is a really weird topic because it's something that I don't like I don't agree with actually I pretty much hate and, um, and I know a lot of people that do this and I'm not trying to shame anybody or turn against anybody in particular but I just it just it just bothers me um, so the topic of this is sex work and people will think okay this goes right back to the kind of person I used to be where I'd shame other women and things like that and this isn't specifically even about just other women this is just sex work in general only fans more than anything else um, I I don't have an issue with other females I don't have an issue with females that are proud of themselves none of that when I was a very different person I did go through a stage where I hated a lot of females I hated most females I was jealous of them I just didn't like them I mean people go through stages where they just don't like people because they're jealous of them or whatever but I don't feel like that anymore there are plenty of women out there that I think are gorgeous and I'm quite obsessed with in a non creepy way I'm just like oh my god she's so pretty um, and I do support you know and it's not that I have an issue with these people and you know like themselves it's more the the fact that they do what they do if that makes sense and I feel very hypocritical because on the one side I believe that your body is your body and nobody should be able to tell you what you can or can't do with your own body like I mean if you want to have sex with someone and they want to 
pay for it, I don't see why that should be legal. But on the other hand, I really hate how everybody now seems to be on OnlyFans. It's like, I just really miss the days when people would keep stuff like that private. You know, if your nudes were leaked, it was something to be ashamed of and like, oh my God, you know, those were meant for one person or one person only or, you know what I mean? Like porn was kept on X hamster or something, you know, but now it's like everybody's pimping themselves out. Just, you know, buy my nudes, buy my nudes. Hey, come see me on OnlyFans and watch me fuck this guy and watch me fuck myself and, you know, watch me finger my asshole. It's just, I'm old fashioned in the way that I think that that kind of stuff should be kept private. And it just, it just really bugs me to see people that I never would have thought would be on the site, on the site, like selling, you know, not selling their body, but almost selling their body, like selling private photos. And I mean, just the most personal private things are just being used for money nowadays, I guess. And I don't know, like people are, you know, oh, girl power, woman power, um, the freedom to do what you want to do. Um, sex work is genuine work and, you know, I should have a right. This is my, my way to empower myself and things like that. And, you know, whatever reason these people have for doing it, whether it's just for money, for shits and giggles, or because they feel empowered, you know, that's, that's besides the point. The thing that I have an issue with is the fact that like so many people now are selling nudes and porn and it's become like the go-to common thing now for everybody making OnlyFans and just sell stuff that used to be private, that used to be personal and it was, it was things that people didn't talk about and I guess it's this whole new sexual freedom wave that's going on. You know, people are, you know, proud to show their dildos and their vibrators and I don't really see guys showing their pocket pussies, but I show, I see girls all the time showing like their dildos and things that they're proud to brag about using to get off with. And I just don't understand what has happened to the world and why people can't keep stuff like that private because things have moved on and things will never, the world will never be the way it once was. That stuff will never be private again, but it's just like a kind of shock to the system, I guess. And it's something that I just personally don't agree with. And I hate seeing it. I hate the fact that it's become commonplace now. It seems like nobody's really got any respect for themselves anymore because I do see it as a sign of, of respect to want to keep things like that private and taking pictures that are sensual but covered is different from taking pictures where you're like spreading your asshole out for everybody to see and there's a point where it crosses the line and it's no longer like artistic and you know to me personally acceptable and it becomes more like just ooh, look at that it's just disgusting to me and I don't know I don't know what it is I don't know how to say it I just I just don't like it at all and I really wish that I'm gonna cover this up for the next minute I really wish that the world would go back to the way it was and people would just you know keep personal things personal and stop just sh over sharing and using sex and porn and their bodies to make a quick buck, you know, like have some self-respect and some decency and just leave some stuff behind closed doors like it used to be. And it's never going to be like that again. And I just, I just don't get how everybody else is okay with it. And you know, there's like a 1% of people that, that agrees with me and sees that this is an issue and it's just kind of, it just shows how fucked up the world is now, I guess.